Hi guys, welcome. I will be giving you a campus tour today and I'll be highlighting some of the key events here on campus. We're currently on the west side of campus and if you look off to your left, you'll see our College of Natural Resources. It includes majors such as insect biology, nutritional science, and others devoted to studying the environment. Off to your right, up here, you'll see Valley Life Sciences Building. It was built in 1930, and today it currently houses the Department of Molecular and Cell Biology, Integrative Biology, as well as Plant Biology. Moffitt Library, one of our undergraduate libraries here on campus. Next to the main entrance uh, is also the Free Speech Movement Cafe, so we have a rich tradition here at Berkeley of political activism, and the free speech movement is one of the most prominent events that have happened throughout our history. Off to your left here is the CV East Asian Library. It is the first freestanding structure built to house an academic East Asian collection on an American university campus, and it also has the largest collection of Japanese maps outside of Japan. So off to your right here, you'll see Memorial Glade, as well as the University Library, also known as Doe Library. Memorial Glade was actually donated to staff and students who fought in World War II. The University Library is the main library on the Berkeley campus. It is one of 27 libraries. Straight ahead, you will see Sather Tower, otherwise known as the Campanile. So it was originally constructed in 1914. So it houses archaeological remains from the La Brea Tar Pits in Los Angeles. Upstairs, you can see a great view of the Bay Area. To your right, this is the Haas School of Business. It was built in 1995, and it was all funded from private donations. To your left, this is the California Memorial Stadium. It contains 75,000 seats, and it's home to our California Golden Bears football team, as well as the women's lacrosse team. All right, turning on to the south side of campus. To your right, this gray building is Worcester Hall. It's one of the most energy efficient buildings here on campus. So it's home to the undergraduate College of Environmental Design, which includes the departments of architecture, landscape architecture, and also city and regional planning. Now, we're headed towards Sproul Plaza. This is right here to your right. So although it's not geographically the center of campus, it very much is so in terms of student life. A lot of different student clubs set out tables, they hand out flyers letting you know about upcoming events and also trying to get more students to join their clubs. And to your right here, this is Zellerbach Hall. So Zellerbach Hall is the main performance auditorium here on campus. This stop here is for the recreational sports facility. This is our student gym here on campus and the gym contains weight rooms, exercise machines, racquetball courts, basketball courts, and a swimming pool. To your left here, we're passing by the Tang Center, and the Tang Center is this salmon and also teal colored building. It's the health service building here on campus. So right now we're on Shattuck Avenue. This is the downtown side of the Berkeley campus. You'll see there's a lot of different eateries, very popular with students. To your left, you'll also see the BART station. BART stands for Bay Area Rapid Transit, and that's our subway system here in the Bay Area. All right, we can see the west area of our campus just ahead. This is Lee Cushing Center for Biomedical and Health Sciences. It's a new 250,000 square foot building that opened in 2012. Thanks for joining us. Have a great day.